cats and kittens, chicks and chickens, it's your buddy Mo Like It, and welcome to episode number 20 of the Weekly Boop. And we're going to start this episode of the Weekly Boop off with the Jutland, the Tier 9 British Destroyer, one of the newest ships in my port. Yes, the, uh, the, the British are here. The full line has been released, and I am grinding the Jutland, and I have found it to be an absolutely amazing ship, capable of amazing things. On a side note, sorry it took me so long to get this out there. Um, you can tell from my voice I'm still a little bit sick, and uh, just work and life have gotten in the way of the boop, guys, and I apologize. But let's start this off right. Oh, those look good. Oh, boop, boop. <laughs> Double strike, baby. Double fucking strike. And oh, oh, is this a little mayhem? Would you like to play with my new ship too? Come at me, bro. The Jutland's got guns, it's got torps, the only thing it doesn't got is speed. Boop! But oh god is it good. Such a good fucking boat. I can't wait to get the good daring and see how that goes. Keeping it British, we've got the Tier 8 British Destroyer, the Lightning. And I am trying to hold back one hell of a push here. So I've set my torpedoes off at a couple battleships. I've got eight. Let's see how many hit. Oh, there looks like a couple. Oh, oh, boop. Yep. <laughs> that Duke of York goes down. Oh, I hit seven out of eight torpedoes. Never a bad thing. Never a dull moment in the lightning when you're single firing torpedoes. But it's not always appropriate to single fire as this Bismarck is pushing me in smoke and I need to make sure... I get him damaged one way or another. So I set off a normal spread and then a few more single fire. And it works pretty fucking effectively as I held back this entire push pretty much by myself. <laughs> oh God, I love these boats. The British DDs have been a pleasant, pleasant surprise. And let's not forget our lower tier British DDs as I'm in the tier 6 Icarus. And I am in my smoke trying to hold back a push on a cap in another game. And I've got an Omaha. Oh, the Omaha. God bless Omahas. They just move so fast that they can't help but butt rush every cap they get into. Every game they're the first one spotted because they do like 35 fucking knots. But it doesn't matter because, boop, torpedoes beat speed all day. <laughs> How'd that push go for you, buddy? Speaking of Omaha's, I'm in my premium U.S. battleship, the Tier 6 Arizona, and nothing more beautiful can be spotted on a map in a battleship than a broadside Omaha. Oh, God. Boop! <laughs> oh, it's so good so beautiful thank you thank you for the omaha thank you so much now i'm in my premium british battleship the duke of york the duke of dork a ship known to be not very effective and i think that's why this chapayev decided to come out and butt rush me but i'm still a battleship and you're still a chapayev so, boop, <laughs> how did that work out for you? <laughs> oh God, oh the joys of this game and the potato-ness. How'd you guys do in ranked? I ranked out in this ranked sprint but, sprint, but I didn't play any cruisers. And here in the premium tier five Italian battleship, I'm gonna show you why I did not play any cruisers whatsoever in ranked battles because of this Boop. <laughs> oh 
Oh, they were not very useful in this season of rank, that's for sure. I'm in my tier 10 German battleship, the Grosser Kurfürst. You ever overextend? You ever get in a bad spot? Well, the Kurfürst doesn't retreat well. It doesn't maneuver well. It doesn't do a lot of things maneuverable. So yeah, I've overextended. I'm about to eat just about every torpedo that has ever been launched in the history of warships. <laughs> and we've got a Minoter. This Minoter's right behind the island here, and he's going, This Kerfus is coming, man. I'm a Minoter. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna torp him. He ain't gonna get me. I'm gonna torp him so fast he's gonna be he's gonna be boop. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. The booper got booped. But still, fuck your couch, get off my map. <laughs> oh god, I love it. Now I'm in my premium tier 7 German battleship, the Scharnhorst. The Scharnhorst has torpedoes. And this lion is about to find out. There is nothing more satisfying in the world than getting a torpedo kill in a battleship. So no matter how much damage I just take or I'm about to take, it was all worth it. It's all worth it because of boop. <laughs> oh, and I could just heal that right back on up. That was no big deal. <laughs> now I'm in my <clears throat> premium tier seven Miyoko clone the Southern Dragon, and we're in the middle of a cyclone in a close game. There was a New Mexico spotted up above the cap here, and I know he's out here, so I go ahead and switch to AP in hopes of running into said New Orleans. The Miyokos are great boats. Oh, oh, are you going to give me broadside? Oh, yeah, turn out just a little bit more, just a little bit more. There you go. Take it. Boop! How'd that work out for you? Not very well. I love it when they do that. <laughs> now I'm in my premium tier 6 Australian cruiser, the HMAS Perth. And we've got a Bayern timidly moving around this island. He knows I'm here. I was spotted. He has to know I have torpedoes. He has to know I'm ready for it. But maybe he's decided, oh, I'm just going to come around this corner and boop him. No, sir. There will be no boops for you. I say hell no to you, sir. I hold my shots to not even give him a shot because he wants to eat all four of my torpedoes. Boop! <laughs> Ah, uh, that should have been a dev strike, but I paced him out, so whatever. Still a beautiful boot. Now this little section is called Krispy Kreme OP. I'd like you to look at the time in the upper right-hand corner as I start playing these clips. The Tier 5 Premium Soviet Cruiser, the Krasny Krim, or as we love to call it, the Krispy Kreme, gets a lot of hate. It gets a lot of hate because it's not known as a very good boat. I love this boat. And this is why. Because in just a short time, with a few well-placed shots, boop, I'm going to get several kills. And they just keep coming. And my ship absolutely annihilates this flank. Now, I'm not alone. I've got a div with me. There's other ships here. It's not like I did this all by myself. You can see I don't get focused all that much. But I place my shots in the right place at the right time when they need to be placed. Because, boop, that's two. Krispy Kreme OP, please nerf. This boat is hilarious. It is fun. It is just powerful enough without being too powerful. It is quirky. It does fun stuff. Boop! <laughs> That's three, you keep in count? <laughs> oh, I love, I love the Krispy Kreme. Oh, hey. 
Hey, little Kuma, you going back up there? How's that working out for you? You feel safe? Boop. Four goal haul in about three minutes. Krispy Kreme OP. <laughs> this is another moment from a ranked battle in the premium tier 5 Soviet destroyer, the Gremiashi, or the Gremi. This ship is not sold, will never be sold, and was nerfed to death with the loss of stealth fire. Remember those days? God, this ship used to be fun when you could stealth fire. Yeah, he got me. But that's a full health October revolution who must not think that I got my torpedoes off. Because he's sailing in a perfect straight line right into a uh, boop. <laughs> High caliber dev strike flesh wound. Oh, it's just wonderful. It's just wonderful. I love the Grimmy. It is nerfed with the loss of its stealth fire abilities, but it is still one hell of a strong ship. I'm here playing it in a random where I've got a CV, both CVs spotted. Their whole team is, is trying to get me dead. And I'm just doing shit. Because it's fun. Because it's tier 5. Who cares? Have some fun. Take some chances. I send off torpedoes at that CV, and I'm pretty sure he's dead. So I decide to get my guns back down on that other CV. This CV comes in with some strike planes. I've got to slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh, God, no. Oh, 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 tuck in your lip. Oh, oh, oh look at him. Boop. <laughs> oh, there's one CV dead. Oh, I overled him a little too much. Let's bring him back. Let's bring him back. Come on, Mo. Let's bring him back. Let's get him down. The guns are so good on this boat. So good. So, so good. Come on, buddy. Come on, die. I wanted a double strike. I wanted a double strike so bad. I deserted. Why am I spotted? Because there's a DD here. Now, Minikaze has butt rushed my smoke. But my torpedoes have just reloaded. There he is. Let's line them up. Let's line them up. Come on, come on. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm dead. But you know what? Torpedoes are in the water. Lieutenant Dan. Ice cream. Boop. <laughs> oh, God. I love that fucking boat. As always, on the weekly boop, we end with a Monoggin clip, the Tier 6 Premium U.S. Destroyer, the Monoggin. Moe's still one of Moe's favoritest boats. Oh, look out, New York, there's some torpedoes over there. Boop! <laughs> this game was close as hell. Later in the same game, if you look at the mini-map, it's me and this Pensacola, and my team is fighting over their cap. If the Pensacola kills me, he can cap us out and win. If I kill the Pensacola, our cap is safe, and no matter what happens at their cap, we're going to win. This Pensacola drove me crazy. He was the torpedo whisperer. Every time I launched torpedoes, he turned. He knew just what to do, and I'm like, damn it, I got to get this guy dead. He won't cooperate. He won't eat my torpedoes. I've got one rack left. You know what? You know what? It's pew pew time. Fuck it. Damn the torpedoes. Let's get at her. Pitter patter. Let's get at her. Pew pew. Come on. Bring it, motherfucker. It's the monoggin. It's the monoggin. You don't want the pew. You can't handle the pew. I'm just going to butt rush you, and you're not going to stop me. Because I am Monoggin. <laughs> Look how just pew pew, guns blazing, baby. Come on. Come on, Pensa. Come on. Come on. Come on, Cletus. You'd be walking over, but you're limping back because I got one rack left. Dodge this motherfucker. You ain't dodging shit. Boop. <laughs> Monogan OP, please nerf. Oh, God. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Send me anything you want to moreplays at gmail.com. As always, nothing but love from Mo to you. Take care of yourselves. Take care of your others. We'll see you out there on the seas, kids. And we will talk to you soon.